I got to tell you, I'm both uh, challenged and excited. Um, my excitement is I can tell you so, some of the cool things that we do at Pickalike, and my challenge is to do this in less than 10 minutes, because the uh, opportunities are virtually endless. So um, at Pickalike, we basically try to uh, teach a very complex system, the human way of perceiving, um, interpreting, and understanding image content. Um, we are uh, a, a B2B company, as uh, Ole mentioned, and um, we are a very research-driven company, and we employ, uh, we have 15 professionals employing three levels of intelligence. Uh, the first one, very, very smart people, um, natural intelligent guys that, that actually fuel uh, a part that uh, we call artificial intelligence, which is only a part of our entire system. And then we have a superficial intelligent, hardly noticeable intelligent guy, and that's me. Um, however, I'm smart enough to hire people that are much smarter than me, and uh, I would be stupid uh, standing in front of such a great crowd not to tell you that uh, we are looking for raw talent, so please, uh, if you uh, belong to this group, um, come and see us uh, uh, at, the, at the fourth floor. Um, so there's a, a change. Uh, I, we fundamentally believe that there is uh, um, visual technology is at the very early stage right now, but it's going to change and it's already changing the way customers um, perceive and, 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 and buy and, and search online. And we've heard a little bit um, earlier um, from Wide Eyes what they do, and we're in a similar field. And I can tell you it's a very complex issue because our brain had you know, thousands and millions of years to evolve what we try to uh, 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 do uh, algorithmically with, with our algorithms. So um, we position us um, as a partner for uh, our companies for our customer companies um, to grow and, and really add value with the products that are out right now. Um, so how uh, and why and, and what does it have to do with you? Well, um, we are uh, in the fashion industry and the fashion industry is very much image driven. It's probably the most visual industry out there, maybe together with furniture, but fashion is probably even more visual. So, and we help in three areas. Uh, we, have, we improve image quality, meaning from the, we look at images, tell you which one are likely to convert better. Uh, we also enhance the image quality itself. Um, we work with uh, image content, so we look at images and relate that to your inventory if you are a shop. Uh, and thirdly, and this is what I want to focus on a little bit, um, image selection. So uh, that basically answers the question, which content at what time uh, do we show our customers and why? And this is relevant because we've heard it earlier today. Um, there is a paradox of choice. You need sufficient um, products to attract a, a good number of customers, but at the same time, you know, too much choice leaves the people paralyzed um, and, and actually leads to less satisfaction when it comes to purchasing things because they get something like it's called bias remorse. So. Um, let me see if I forgot something. Uh, also, because of the fact that um, we, are, we, we had this huge shift from uh, um, desktop to mobile, where we have less space available, I think uh, Luis mentioned it as well, um, you really have to be smart about which content to show when. So how do you get from inspiration to transaction? How do you actually, how do you actually show your customers what is really relevant to them at the time that it is relevant to them? Uh, well, our answer would be smart personalization. And with smart, we, if we say uh, uh, we uh, are in a visual-driven environment, we start with the image number one, and then we all obviously take all the things that you can't uh, uh, take out of an image, like price, like brand, or you know, customer history and, and things like that, into account also the current customer behavior. So, from that, we actually developed a few products where, where I want to single out um, one. And uh, this is uh, from our Visualytics suite. It's a fancy name for a very simple outfit generation tool. And I've only showed you, um, I'm only going to show you a few uh, slides. But that's basically um, 
you know, this is the second step. You get, you get a preview from different categories, and, uh, and then you, you click into one category, and then you actually have the possibilities to you know, set your, what, what, what really matters, your preferences. Is it more the color? Is it more the shape? Is it the brand? Is it the price range? Things like that. And from that, um, you derive um, outfits which really, really convert well. And, um, and you, you can involve much more product than these original six, but what this slide is essentially telling you we are a fashion tech company, not a fashion tech company. So uh, uh, my, actually my wife uh, uh, was kind of um, upset when she saw that th this is, these were the products that I picked out. But it's just for you to illustrate that um, you know, you can, you can, this chain goes on very long and you actually uh, involve many, many more products than you originally started with. So um, that has a, a very strong impact on performance, especially on conversion, also on uh, the dropout rate, uh, because you, you really inspire people um, uh, uh, with content that is relevant for them. And uh, thirdly, you boost up and cross-selling, because if we go back, uh, I don't only have a, a, a complementary recommendation for this shoe, but also for this, 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 and this. And you see here, in the first column, the skirt always stays the same, uh, stays the same and, and the others switch through. It's just a, a question of how we display it, actually. And uh, here, the, the shoes stay the same and the rest and so on and so forth. I couldn't show it all to you right now. So um, these are some of our customers that, that are currently implementing this, this outfit and Shop the Look style. They have other products already in place. And, um, yeah, I hope I could, you know, inspire you a little bit and make you curious. And if you want to learn more, talk to me, meet me. Um, that's it. Thank you very much.